Hi, I'm Paul from PDH Sports, leading online racket specialist, and today um, we're taking a sort of first look at the new Babolat Aero range. So um, I'm also got with me today Ollie, who's our tennis resident expert. So Ollie's been helping me. Uh, he's been. We're starting to get a few video reviews out there on the rackets. Um, Ollie's a bit of a, uh, a Wilson man at the moment, so we've got a Wilson racket, so it'll be interesting to get your take on the Bablat. Uh, first of all, um, this sort of this is to do with like a brand new launch of rackets. We've got the new Aero rackets. This range is endorsed by Rafa Nadal. Um, first thing then, Ollie, uh, colorways. What do you think to the new yellow? Because the racket's always been black and yellow, but this is what color, what would how do you describe this? The colour, the slightly more garish mustard colour, but it's uh, it's quite nice actually. I think it, it suits quite well with the uh, the heavily uh, black uh, colourway as well. So I think it's quite nice. Yeah, so it's like uh, like uh, like I said, the the Aero range has always traditionally been yellow. So uh, they've gone for sort of like as you can see, like a slightly more mustardy feel. So when I was told it was mustard, I wasn't 100% <laughs> sure how they're going to come out, but um, they've certainly. It's certainly grown on me. I, I think when it, I, I, I was a little bit flat when I first saw it, yeah. thinking I'm not sure, but actually, it's quite. Um, it's almost understated, but um, I, I've actually grown to to like the the, the new yes. mustard mustard <laughs> colour. So, if we look into a little bit of detail with the bag, so we've got there's five bags in the range. So if we start off, we've got the ever the most reliable backpack. So. Um, I mean, uh, I don't know, do you, do you use a backpack? I do, yeah, yeah. So, I mean, what we're finding, more and more people now that are playing tennis, I mean, like, as you can see here, it's ideal for, uh, uh, you know, carrying, like, maybe one racket, if you're just, like, nipping down to the club. I know my kids, you know, like, uh, they have got bags, but they, they tend to just use backpacks because of the, the convenience. So more and more people are using yeah. backpacks. So um, if we have a little look at this one, um, you you know you've got the padded padded shoulder straps, um, padded back, which is always yeah. useful. I mean, what what are you when you if you're using a backpack? What are the main things that you're uh, looking for in a bag, Ollie? Uh, I'd probably say making sure it's nice and sturdy. The material on certainly on the Pure Drive backpack is uh, sorry the Pure Aero backpack is uh, it's it's very sturdy. So it's uh, you always feel like you're gonna have a uh, nice bit of durability out of it. Yeah. Um, so I mean, like this is this is their sort of premium range of bag so you've definitely got like I say like a more sort yeah. of, more sort of sturdy stronger bag and um, we've got like on the front um, large compartment so it's yeah. fairly large yeah, one large main compartment we've got a couple of accessory pockets so you can put your keys and your phone in that one on the other side and um, also on the the top here we've got like a little pouch for uh, again more more accessories yeah. so if you've got accessories this bag there's <laughs> plenty of space for them also um separate bit of the bag uh, at the back for your racket so which is quite cool and it also comes with a rain cover so pretty useful at the moment yeah, with all the, the the british weather um certainly like last night my kids were they've got a babble up bag and uh chucking it down with rain so on the way down to the club is quite useful and um, yeah, so also at the bottom here, which I don't know if you, has your Wilson bag got one of these? Uh, it does, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> so we've also got um, like, which I mean, what would you, do you put your shoes in there? Or yeah, I, I often carry just like a spare pair, just like a running trainer, just something I can uh, have whilst I'm not on court, just a nice and, uh, so it's, it's nice and easy to use. Um, but yeah, so obviously the Pure, uh, Pure Aero bag does have that, so it's a, uh, it's Always. also ventilated, so you if go. you've got any like smelly feet, smelly yeah. feet or, I mean, I suppose you can also put your kit in yeah, there yeah. as well, so yeah. separate keeps it separate from the rest of the uh, your equipment. So yeah, that's the Babalat Aero backpack. So also, um, what we've got here is the racket bags. So as you can see. Uh, there's four different bags, so like Ollie also touched upon, uh, you know, like wanting a sturdy bag. So, as these are in their sort of like 
top end range what you are going to get is you can tell by the quality of it um, you know like this bit on the on the larger bags have got an actually sort of yeah. hardened protection but there's three different models uh, so we've got the three the six the nine and the twelve so basically the way that the, most of the bags are graded they come into the, they're saying like you could fit up to 12 rackets nine rackets six rackets and three rackets so um, if we have a little look at the details of this bag so the the three just comes with one strap so again probably best suited to uh, somebody that's not looking to hold loads of kit it's yeah. more if you're just walking down to the club and you're not planning on uh, uh, using the club to get changed and everything and you just put in your rackets um, so probably ideal for you Ollie, Ollie lives like right next door to the tennis club so kind of bag yeah, that would suit you so um, you can see here one large main compartment um, so it's only got one shoulder strap you've got accessory pockets on the side and then I think that's a new feature because I can't recall that being on the others but it's got like a, a, a you can see it there like a bit of a protective yeah. cushioned side bit so I can't recall that being on the the previous model bags and then again more accessories so Babalat loves these accessory pockets there are lots of accessories and then uh, customize your bag so you can log on to mybabalat.com and on the, the here you can basically fill in your details and you can, I think it comes out with a printout so you yeah. can actually sort of customize all of your your bag with your name and address right so bag number two um, so you know have you have you got a racket bag yeah yeah so yeah. which what size are you using so I'm using a 12 racket bag at the minute um, for when I need it um, but like I said mostly using the backpack but so the 12 obviously is the biggest. Um, Ollie's like you're you're quite a serious player. You play a few tournaments, so I guess like the, you know if you're if you're wanting to take everything down, then rather than the three racket bag, the 12. Uh, do you use that then instead of like a uh, a holder, just literally? Yeah, take your... yeah. I love pretty much everything I need. I love uh, sort of two or three rackets, um, like a spare compartment for my like you know, your kit, your shoes and stuff like that. And then uh, I think it, it gives up uh, enough space for everything you're ever going to need. So uh, yeah, excellent. So um, right, so if you look at the the six bag, so so the main differences between the six and the three, which personally I think is for me is like a big plus is the fact it comes with the double shoulder yeah. strap because you know if you've got to walk anywhere or you even your bike again I keep referring back to my own children they're often coming down on the bike like one thing is easier is the backpack carry system rather than having it just across so if you know if you upgrade to the six um, you get the the double backpack carry system features are pretty much the same so you've got like the cushioned side accessory bit um, again the one upgrade from the three here is that you have two uh, large compartments so this one comes with a ther thermoguard keeping your your strings and your rackets protected maybe when it gets a little bit warmer um, and then the second compartment is just like your normal so you probably put your kit in that side keep your rackets inside um, and again another quite large side accessory pocket so yeah so that's the six so that's the main difference is that one so that also just going back quickly to the three it hasn't got the thermoguard so no. so a couple of sort of key upgrades really if you're going to go from the three to the six which you may find are quite useful so the nine so we have a look at the nine bag so I guess the nine so the nine actually comes with See the width of this a little bit wider, so yeah. maybe if you hold that one on, it'll just show you the width difference between the two. So, certainly a little bit wider, and then also uh, you've got the three compartments, haven't you? So, you've got yeah, one large central one, and side one with the thermoguard, and 
Then the third pocket, which is a normal one, not got a thermal guard, but it's got you've got like that extra. So again, the bit, the upgrade really. Same key features with the accessories, bubble accessory pocket, side pocket. But the big difference between the six and the three is you get that additional yeah. uh, side one. So again, if you've got more rackets or more equipment, you might consider the nine. Then the final bag in this new lineup is the big 12R. So again, probably the more serious player that wants to take everything. I mean, also I see like now so many of the little kids walking around with these bags that are as big as them, but literally um, it's got the three. So it's got the three compartments the same as the nine. Let's see what the main differences are. So you've got your shoulder straps, and then let's see. So you've got one side compartment with the thermoguard. Let's see where the bottom side. So two. So again, the main difference between the nine and the twelve really is that you've got two sort of thermoguard um, compartments for your racket, and then you've got that one large central compartment for your equipment. So I wonder if that's got. So on the on the on the 12 as well, you've got the ventilated shoe compartment. So you have that on the nine. You do, yeah. So oh, it's also included on the nine, which I didn't mention earlier. So both the nine and the 12 have a central bit where you can separate maybe your kit. It's all ventilated. You could probably put your shoes. You could get your shoes in there. Um, yeah. So it's highlighted as like a shoe compartment at the bottom. So got the Bablat styling on the 12 at the bottom, Bablat all over the, the shoulder straps, um, they've all got the Bablat on the bottom. So yeah, so new range. Yeah. Are you going to give it a thumbs up or the thumbs down for the... I think it's a definite thumbs up for me. I think the quality really stands out in, uh, in the, pure, the pure range because like I say, the, the sort of this, it's almost like a carbon fibre sort of... Uh, Aesthetic too. I think it, it looks really smart, um, and you certainly get what you pay for. I think yeah. so it's uh, I, good. I think I definitely agree with that. I think like, the thing is with all of the uh, um, Babalat sort of performance bags, then you know like, we've had no issues with no. like the durability. Um, you're really going to get like a, a quality bag, um, and you know maybe if you're into the aero range, then this is perfect. For you, uh, you can look at the upgrade into the new the new rackets. Um, but yeah, so this is like these are the so there's five new bags that we've got in the range. One backpack, three R, six R, nine R, and twelve R. And um, really, this is just a, our first look at these bags in a little bit of detail. They are all available at pdhsports.com and uh, if you've not already subscribed to our YouTube channel, that's where we, we're sort of uh, trying to give like a few more of these type of videos. We're doing, we do full reviews uh, on the rackets, the shoes, the bags and uh, this, is like a, this is like a new style video that we're trying to do where we're kind of giving a bit of a, uh, a closer look and um, you know, we're able to offer uh, a quicker look as well at the new bags and any new products that come out. So don't forget to check out the channel and also don't forget to check out our pdhsports.com website.